to analysis done by the Institute of Chartered Accountants, Ghana, 17 banks will have their capital adequacy ratio below 10%, while nine of these banks will have a negative net-owned fund. This is contained in a document Ghana Association of Banks shared with its members and available to three business. This corroborates three business reports last Friday that almost all the banks will require additional capital or lose their license if the debt exchange is implemented. Bank of Ghana requires all banks to have a capital adequacy ratio of 13% and intends to review it down to 10% as part of the easing of banking restrictions to cushion banks against the impacts of the debt restructuring program. This means only six banks out of the 23 may be able to meet even the lowered capital adequacy ratio. The banks will therefore need an additional capital of 16 billion cities. The document also indicates that the banking sector would lose about 5.9 billion cities in revenue alone, incur a loss before tax of about 14.5 billion cities, and would require more than 20 billion cities to meet their cash needs. The banks warn that there will be job losses and they will also be compelled to scale back on their operations.